you are observing the internal structure of the heart upper chambers are called auricles lower chambers are called ventricles this is the left side and this is the right side left atrium opens into left ventricle here is the opening this opening is guarded by wall mitral wall mitral wall is also called as bicuspid wall and you can see here another one wall that is where the right atrium opens into right ventricle that is called tricuspid wall okay and you can see another one wall where here aorta uh, originate from the left ventricle there aortic wall present and where the pulmonary artery origin in right ventricle there pulmonary wall present you are observing the uh, main blood vessel which originate from left ventricle that is aorta and the blood vessel originate from the right ventricle that is pulmonary artery okay this is the pulmonary artery and this one is the aorta here uh, aortic wall present this one is pulmonary wall four walls okay this is the septum divides two ventricles and here is the septum divides uh, auricles from the ventricles and here is another one septum present that septum divides two auricles okay let us observe these parts in the mammalian heart you are observing the mammalian heart uh, uh, that is uh, taken from the sheep you are observing the four chambers of the heart upper chambers are called auricles lower chambers ventricles see the walls are very thin when compared to the ventricle walls especially left ventricle wall is uh, very thicker when compared to other chambers of the heart that is the septum which uh, separates two auricles interauricular septum and also there is a septum showing there auriculo ventricular septum present which separates auricles from ventricles and you are observing another one septum which separates two ventricles think why the left ventricle walls are very thicker when compared to other chambers left auricle is filled with the oxygenated blood pulmonary veins collect oxygen the opening of the pulmonary vein you are seeing now the pulmonary vein collects oxygenated blood from lungs and uh, gives that to the left auricle when that left auricle contracts blood comes into ventricle you are observing the opening that opening is guarded by bicuspid wall and there deoxygenated blood is collected by the pre and post caval veins and that blood comes into the right auricle when right auricle contracts blood flows into right ventricle there is the opening that opening is guarded by there guarded by tricuspid wall yes there tricuspid wall located you can observe the cauda tendine here and here also and now you are observing the aorta systemic aorta systemic aorta it originate uh, from the left ventricle here there is another where the systemic aorta originate there aortic walls present that is the systemic aorta you are watching now the straw which is inserted in systemic aorta and another one straw you are observing that that is a uh, uh, open into pulmonary artery 
pulmonary artery originate from the right ventricle there where the pulmonary artery originate in that region pulmonary valves present in the 